pause. Wait a minute. I'm good. Okay. And then here is the plates that I did, like some of designs for you using this uh, beautiful crystal kit. This is available right now. You can definitely have your hand and experience it yourself because I'm so obsessed with the designs. Even those you like using all the cute designs from the kits don't have a centerpiece absolutely no problem you can still bling out so many designs with this and it's hard to pick which one so i'm thinking if this one gonna be on my thumb to matching with this one i love this one so much also you can do this with different colors it doesn't have to be in the sapphire and uh green opal so i'm gonna use this beauty on my thumb and then i'm thinking of doing this on my rings finger what do you think so let me know because we're gonna have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven eleven uh designs so i only have five nails so i'm gonna do the thumb first i'm gonna apply is one good coat of the condensed glue gels if you're having any of the uh, troubleshooting with the crystal placement and your crystal uh, placement or designs look so beautiful and then it was like come up in one or two days or it's not even stay you definitely going to need this beauty this bestie on your desk so i'm gonna go ahead and floating the you know white top coat right on the top so you're not going to uh, spread the bristle just floating right on the top this way is going to have another layer to even grab the base of the crystal even uh, better and also it would not um leave any residues a sticky layer at all after you finish and you don't have to worry about say it's like coating it around the uh crystal so i'm floating it's really good and we are going to adhere the crystal on i'm gonna try to hold is that better okay. it's good it's okay yeah sometimes it's fun to do your own nails and then sometimes it can be really challenge uh, move. just move it all right, so I'm not using this design. I'm so obsessed with this. It looks like a black, but it's not. You gotta experience it yourself when you have the kids in your hand. You know exactly what colors I'm talking about. I'm gonna use a frame, and in a little bit, when I finish with these two nails, I'm gonna show you the kids. And I did have unboxing the kids yesterday. It's really cool. Okay, it's funny because. I lean on that, uh, the candles, and it kind of looks crooked. But the best thing about these condensed glue gels and no wipe top coat is the you have all the time in the world to adjusting your crystal placement. So if you are thinking you need to adjusting it, like up and down, left or right, you have all the time in the world it's not going to set and i'm going to using the other end of a crystal pickers um to adjusting it and i'm gonna apply it right there i'm so in love with this And I saved the, the pose for all of us. So then we can always um, get some picture preference. And on the picture, I didn't put any beads on. You know what? Keep in mind, if you don't want any beads on, you absolutely can go, can get away with or without beads. Can you get me some beads over there? Or oh, the tray bead because I don't want to destroy this one right there. To go on the back. I think my beads are somewhere.
I'm gonna go ahead. And apply this. And kind of really interesting because when you're doing it for your nails, it can be fun and also it can be a little bit um it's okay, just open this. Okay, leave it here. And don't worry about the um, perfect right now because you are going to adjusting it before you cure. The whole entire beads collection in a crystal room, you can just go and get one scoop out here faster. I'm gonna go ahead and put the crystal, the beads on the, um, between the crystal and the frame. You know, I'm doing my dominant hand right now. So this is like a lot of us will be having um, really a challenge for this. Do not worry. Only you need to do is just um, give yourself some time. And if you feel like it is um, going different direction because it's the left hand doing for right hand. Um, just take your time. It's not going anywhere. It's not going to cure. I mean, not going to dry until you are going to um, not going to cure. So I'm going to continue to add the beads on. And now I just have you have me getting some beads because the, the crystal kit is on one side. And I'm doing on the left, I mean my left. So I'm going to be really patient. You know what? Keep in mind, if you don't want any beads on, you can definitely gear it and then you're good to go. Put precision glue gels on. Mm -hmm. And you like to see, you don't need big fancy centerpiece. All you need is good old round crystal and you can create amazing design for them. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and adjusting all of my crystal first before I cure. It's really, it can be really a fun and also okay, a little bit of the challenge when you're doing a your dominant hand. Grab up on the end. This one like, hey, I'm going, I'm leaving. So it looks really beautiful right now and also it kind of um, a lot of details I'm gonna do. I'm gonna flash key it first. Let me get the can you get my uh black light the flashlight mm -hmm. the last light here. And then right there. Mm -hmm. 
is in my purse. Hey, it was cool though, and it struggled for real. Look, not frustrated at all. It's just like, I'm gonna chase you. Hold up. Let me get it quick. I'm gonna pull it off the camera because I can't see it. You know, flash key on this one for me first. On this end first. This end first. Okay. And then, hold on. Flash key on this one. That's awesome. Yep, no frustrated at all.